Hello viewers, a lot of users actually want to know about the file app that you get on iOS devices whether it is iPhone or iPad. Actually this app is very feature rich. You have to know certain things to use this app properly. If you open the app you can see that the interface of this app looks like this. If you open the files app at the left corner you will get recents and then there is shared and there is locations and after that there is favorite and then tags if you click on recents you will get all the files that have been stored on your iCloud drive and then if you click on share if you have shared anything with your friends or family members it will show here so I haven't shared anything after that if you click on locations in locations there are three folders actually iCloud drive on my iPad and recently deleted if you click on iCloud drive you can see that all the images and your mp3 files and also PDF files are stored here it is actually showing the iCloud drive so you can access this you can download this on your iPad and if you click on on I, my iPad this is the local storage actually these two things are stored in your local storage that is internal memory of this ipad and these are the recently deleted item now i will go into the photos app here all the things are stored in my ipad suppose i want to save this in file app so i have to click and press like this and then i have to click on share and then many options will appear and scrolling down you have to select the save to files okay if you click on save to files it will automatically show you the location where you want to save suppose I want to save it locally on my iPad and then I will click save and now I will go into file app again and then you can see that the photos have been stored here as you can see here this picture now i will delete the copy from photos here i will delete this picture yet i can access this picture in files app so what i suggest that there are two locations it is not connected with photos app photos app takes up internal storage and on the other hand file app takes internal storage but they are not the same storage now if you want you can also copy move or share this again to your photos app like this save image and now you can see that your photo again is stored in the internal storage in the photo app so in this way you can access both photos and files app and now if you want to access your iCloud you have to go to Safari and then click on iCloud and here you can see that drive notes photos all the things are categorized also calendar notifications you can access these things and if you want you can delete things and that will be permanently deleted and you will not get that photos or videos if you delete from here if you have multiple iOS devices like MacBook iPhone iPad and if you use the same iCloud storage in that case there will be syncing and the syncing process is very smooth on iOS devices as you can see here actually 50 GB has been filled up so the process of syncing has been paused so if I want to get more storage I have to buy the 200 GB storage now again I have to go into file app here is downloads you can see all the things that you have downloaded from your browser next there is tags actually tags are of different colors it is actually helpful if you want to categorize things with this color suppose you want to tag anything with the blue color so what you have to do you have to select the files or photo or image or video you want to categorize like this you can see that there is no blue tag here so I will add a blue tag here what I have to do I have to click on on my iCloud drive and then I will select suppose this item this image and if you click and press you can see that there are various options move 
copy move share and now you have to click on tags and it will show various kinds of colors here at the bottom you can see tags there are various kinds of colors you have to choose the blue color as i want to save it with the blue color now if you click again you can see that the blue tag is already there and if you click on blue it will show the picture as you can see here so in this way you can categorize things if you have a lot of stuffs in your filed app so you can categorize them with various colors and if you want you can also make custom color so this is the file app analysis hope this video has become helpful to you if you have any questions regarding this app or any other app or any other tablet you can ask me in the comment section below i will try to answer those questions to the best of my knowledge thank you very much for watching this video have a great day